Hi, I'm Eric Bracke, and you're watching the iPortal interface. In this video, I'll show you how you can use the iPortal to demonstrate user roles and governed self-service in a ClickSense deployment. Let's begin with using roles in ClickSense to build governance guardrails in the application lifecycle. The default roles in ClickSense sites typically resemble the following. An admin would be responsible for the overall upkeep and maintenance of the deployment. A developer might have access to data sources to build data models, handle data reload task creation, and manages publishing apps out to the users. Designers' jobs typically involve delivering front-end applications based on the data model supplied by a developer. An analyst might extend applications with new sheets and stories for their own use. And finally, a consumer would have read-only access into the ClickSense applications that have been created. We find that as the needs of a business change and grow, gaps appear in the roles dictating what users can see and do within a self-service analytics platform. To address these gaps, ClickSense security rules define new roles and capabilities for different types of users to participate in the platform. A team administrator addresses maintenance tasks in the domain that they are responsible for. As a result, multiple team administrators may exist in a ClickSense deployment, yet have visibility only to a certain stream of content and resources. Their role is to manage access to ClickSense resources they have responsibility for. A contributor is a higher level app consumer from the analyst because they can create and share content with a broader community of users in a ClickSense deployment. The addition of these two roles reflects the needs of an enterprise to further segregate duties while providing flexible frameworks to enable users to create and discover meaningful insights in the way that they prefer. The purpose of the iPortal is to make it easier to test, audit, and demonstrate the access controls of the roles in a ClickSense deployment so you can achieve governed self-service safely and efficiently. The iPortal is a great way to identify guardrails that are applied to users. Ready to get started with the iPortal today? Click on the link below to download the iPortal and be sure to watch the in-depth videos and read the step-by-step -step guides on how to configure Click Govern Self-Service. Thank you.